Hi everyone, today I'm going to do a quick demo with Hugging Face, Long Chain and Streamlet. So before I jump into the demo, let me just quickly run through a few things. So Large Language Model, since last year November, uh, <clears throat> OpenAI launched their product ChatGPT. It gains tremendous popularity among the all the users. So uh, after that, Google, Meta, and Tropic, they all came out with their own large language models. So the war of uh, generative AI becomes more and more popular. Then uh, let me just quickly talk about Hugging Face. So it's an open source platform with 120K models and large number of data sets and demo on it. Uh, it focus on democratizing AI and make it accessible to all the engineers. It has this um, transformer library which makes the whole downloading of model, running model much easier. Then uh, I will also run through this uh, Streamlet which is a very very useful uh, web application tool for data scientists. It's in, it's written in Python. Uh, it allows user to create a web page just with a few lines of code and it has a very rich data vi visualization uh, libraries. So uh, let's jump into Hugging Face. So Hugging Face uh, is a platform if you come here you can see there are models, databases, and spaces. So model Today I'm going to uh, utilize this image to text model to do the demo. So Hugging Face allows you to test the model online. That's a very useful uh, feature. So you don't have to start anything without knowing the model and whether it works. So let's say for this model, you can simply upload an image and it will uh, generate a caption for you. A car parked in the parking lot with mountains in the background. It looks quite accurate. So uh, later I will run through the demo of this. Um, okay, let me switch to my uh, IDE. So <clears throat> this is my code. Just a few lines. It actually uh, has a few things happening in here. So let me just first run through my Streamlet app. So if you see these are the lines which created this web app using Streamlet. So set the title, then enable a image upload feature, checking whether the image is uploaded. So once it's uploaded, I will pass this image to the uh, model from Hugging Face. If you go here, you can see just a few lines of code. At first, you need to define the model name, then use pipeline, define the model and the task, then <coughs> simply pass the image to this model. It will return you the text. Then I sort of print it out for, uh, for the uh, login purpose. Then after that, I will so if we come back here, I will also will pass this text to, uh, to the open AI model. So using with long chain. So first, just to initiate the model with a uh, temperature zero point seven. So I don't want it to be too extreme in this test case. Neither one nor zero. So then pass in the key. Then you just need to define your uh, prompt. So write me a short story about below text, limited the story to 100 words. The text is here where you, the, where is the output of the hugging face model. Then uh, create a prompt temp, uh, template with this, temp, uh, with this uh, prompt. Then define a variable. Then eventually I, pa I will pass this with the uh, the input query to the large language model. Then you will return me a story. Okay, so let me just quickly rerun this streamlet run main. So it will start the web. 
Okay, just browse to a image. Let's say the same image. It will be uploaded to the local hosted web page. Just give it a few seconds for it to run. Okay, here is the story output from the uh, OpenAI model. Okay, so it's a story written. Yeah. With this, I conclude my demo. Thanks everyone for watching.